I came to Malaysia about seven years ago because there was so much of terrorism and fighting going on back in my country. So it, it became very unsafe for my family and I. When I first came to Malaysia, I wasn't in school for one year. Then a friend of my mom found a school in Chowkit. It was a school for the underprivileged. I was 12 then. When I was there, I actually felt very marginalized because I was the first very few non-Malaysians there. And people would not call me by my name, but they would call me by my nationality and they would be like, Hey, Pakistan, Marisini. One day, my mom's friend told us about dignity. So I was very excited I finally could get proper education. So I still remember my first day when I came in to the class. I was literally shocked by the amount of races mingling together and the teachers encouraging them to sit together and study. Unlike my previous experiences in Karachi and Chowkit, here, even though I could barely speak English, I felt so accepted. So it was really nice. I have learned netball and football here. At first, I didn't know anything about netball and now I can play various positions in netball as I've been participating in Final Cup for four years now. I also got to try football for the very first time in Dignity. I was so shocked to hear that girls could play football too. And today, I'm helping to coach a team in Dignity to play football. Dignity is like my second home. I have not only improved academically in Dignity, but also as a person. Here is where I realized that I have a role to play in transformation of my community. I remember Pastor once asking me, how are you going to give back to your community? I am going to be an agent of transformation, that's how. My dream is to become a neurosurgeon because I like challenges and I find it quite interesting to study the most amazing and the most complex human organ. I would also like to join Doctors Without Borders. It is a medical humanitarian organization because I would love to serve where the need is the greatest. If I could describe dignity in one word, it would be dignity. I felt accepted and dignity and dignity means to be worthy of respect and self-esteem. I received respect and my self-esteem from dignity.